Hello my friend, how are you today? This is Yuda. And today I want to tell you about something really, really special about the remote controller. This kit is very, very good. The Skydroid T10. So if you are looking for something uh, long range system with uh, using your APM or Pixox or NASA, this is a very good deal and i recommend it i have like 10 like this i use in my uh, other brown and this system include the the uh, transmitter and receiver and camera inside them so what i want to show you what you get in the box we're gonna open it and i'm gonna sh show you what you have inside Sorry about my dog, it's barking. So in the box you get this kit, okay? So we're gonna open, and this is what you get, the remote controller, okay? And this part is the bracket for the phone, okay? This is very, very good. Normally it's come with a battery inside, so it's a 18650 battery inside one press and long press and it's come like three seventy five percent and when it's beeping uh, it's meaning that it's not connecting to any rc any receiver so this one is very nice look at this i from the i ordered it from aliexpress they fix it for me this for the using my drone you can see this coming into the center the gimbal so you have like 10 channel on this remote and three position here three position here and this is for the gimbal this is the one two and three and four and you have one one here you see long press and you see highlight and highlight so for closing you can push long press and it's closed it's very good a remote controller they give me the spare of the gimbal if you want to fix to a two stick in the center you get the usb cable one usb port is connecting here for charging the small one and the usb here it's for out for the video camera into your phone or your tablets and let's see you have the usb we have two cable inside here this this one the t1 it's using for here you can take it and it's using for your phone plug into your phone you plug it here okay and the other one for charging and i see they give me two the same but it's okay it's normally you can uh, charge with this one for charging and one for the phone i'm sorry <laughs> no this is they give you the the charging and for using is the same they give you a c type i'm sorry and they give you a micro usb for your phone so if you have a phone in c using this if you have a micro usb using this one and this go to your phone into here we have also a strap here this is the strap for you holding the remote controller on your neck and this is the receiver this is very very nice receiver long range it's coming with telemetry if you're using pixoc it's very easy they get one go into the using the pixoc all the same I'm gonna to explain to you how to connect this in the next video, but this is what you get here. It's very nice, very good system. So here, it's all the channel. This part, the last one, it's yellow and white and black. So this is the telemetry. It's go to the Pixoc or APM by this one. And the, the signal, it's using the first one. If you can see here, it's have P, 
PS this is for the negative plus and um, minus so the signal is going to go to the center down and the upper ones here in this row it's going to be the ground ground a uh, plus 5 volt and a uh, signal okay so if you're using ppm or s bus only plug one here you can use pwn by using the this channel 10 channel here i use ppm or s bus they give you uh, this the spring for to change it to to uh, stick in the center okay this is the what they, you get in the box and this is the camera the camera is very very nice so it's coming with the own system of yourself it's very easy this can I show you the camera this camera is nice it's long range is by uh, skydroid as you see very very nice and very easy to connect you just put mounted this on your drone and this is a long uh, system by i think around the uh, two kilometer to three up to you and this is the what you need to do this in the receiver you have usb this is for uh, updating software and this is go into the camera this one telemetry this one s bus and you see here this go inside here so this is one for the camera so you make sure everything is like that look it like this and this is down this is down you plug it here very easy it's it's popping inside and then you go to the camera the same stuff look at the pin the same orientation and everything and you can plug it like this and you have app that you can use it and you can watch it i will show you now wait i'm gonna plug it so this one is down and down just plug it inside like this and it's really good okay so this is it my friend this is what you get in the set this is very very mount into your drone this is the drone that i build with the nasa system so you need to take only only here you get the five volt from the here from the let's take it out from x2 see x2 it's the signal so the the top is black the same and red and yellow so this one you're going to take one of uh, this and show you i have in the box yes you can take one cable just to demonstrate you how to do that you take cable as this one and you just snap it here inside the black is on the top and this one is gonna go on the top here but the first one remember the first one not the uh, channel one channel uh, ps and you're gonna plug it like this and when you plug it the battery i give you the battery right? you can see it's working make sure before you plug battery to take off the prop okay <laughs> so you not have any damage plug it here and it should go you can see it's gonna go green i i will see it's green yeah you can see green okay maybe they make you bound to the sky droid but if you want to rebind the two let's open this make sure look if it if it will be ping it's not binding oh see it's not binding so i'm going to show you how you make it okay so what you have to do now close the remote controller and 
we're gonna do six times this okay like this one two three four five six and plug it and this is gonna go to binding see it's flashing green now when you open this remote controller it will bind automatic one and long and look and this is how you bind now it's solid green with this amount it's mean that it's binding and everything is perfect in this drone we not have telemetry here on this uh, flight controller you see but uh, you can take this out if you want to use it the nasa i not use telemetry because i not have uh, it's not like the pixel so i use uh, with the pixel with the telemetry it's another video and i use osd on this drone so i hope you like this video and i show you this uh, remote controller i put the link in the description you can buy it's affiliate link so if you buy i can get one dollar or something like that just for help you to do this channel and if you like me and you want to help it's okay homely but anyway i enjoy to help you and show you what we have in the box thank you for watching and please like and subscribe this help to to me to make you more video because it took me a long time just to do this all this and next video i'm going to show the skydroid how to using the app they have two app that you need to download it's the setting app for this remote controller that you need to do and the other app it's a uh, for the camera fpv camera i can show you uh, wait a second <laughs> Okay, next video I'm going to show you how to do with the app, it's better. Thank you for watching, I see you in the next video, mm, goodbye.